Yeah, you know, it was an emotional day for the Duquesne men's basketball program. It's a time that is now being called the Dambrot era because Keith Dambrot has done something that this team has not accomplished in 47 years. The Duquesne men's basketball program is going dancing. After winning the A-10 championship, the Dukes earned a bid to the NCAA tournament. The very next day, head coach Keith Dambrot announces he is retiring. I didn't want to cheat it, and I, I just felt like, you know, I could see myself losing that edge at some point, and that's why I just said, you know, I, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to end like that. I, I'm, I'm not built that way. Obviously, everyone sees the accolades and everything that he's done on the court, but I can promise you that he, he's even a better person off of it. The players told me Coach Dambrot did gather them before this press conference to let them know that he would be announcing his retirement. They all still showed up to offer their support, and I couldn't help but notice they were sporting something special from the A-10 championship. I see you have part of the net in your hat. A few of you players had that. Is that something the entire team did? How did you come up with that idea? Um, I think some of, some of the guys saw it before, and I think we did it. Um, a lot of the guys did it. I, maybe everyone has done it. Everyone doesn't have their hats on today, but most of the guys who do have their hats on today, they did have their net. Um, I think it's just a unique kind of style thing, um, just to show it off and be able to have that with the accomplishment of the hat. Duquesne will take on a BYU in the first round of the NCAA tournament, and they will play that game this Thursday in Omaha, Nebraska. Live here at Duquesne, I'm Emily John Greco for Pittsburgh's Action Sports.